Hello everyone, here in this video, I am going to show you that how you can display color swatches as well as images swatches in your Shopify store. So basically Shopify has upgraded this feature and now it is available for all the free themes. For example, you have uh, refresh theme, down theme, ride theme, sense, uh, origin, spotlight, craft, taste, studio, uh, crave, publisher, color block trade so in all these free themes this method will be applied so this is quite simple so you just need to go back to the dashboard of the store and here you can see i have installed down theme the version 15.1.0 and then after you should uh, go back to the products and here you can see uh, for example i have this product which is fashion t-shirt so the first step is that you should select the category uh, in most of the cases the category has been selected by the shopify itself but if that is not selected then you can actually select that uh, category category here for example i am selecting this apparel and accessories then save the changes and scroll it down a little bit and you will see that all the uh, colors i have mentioned here like navy white peach blue green yellow and we have the size variant as well uh, once you are scrolling it a little bit down you will find out that we have a category meta field so that will be appearing only if you have selected this uh, category here otherwise it will not appear so you should click on this color and then here we have the options you should click on it and for example right now i have uh, all those colors like white then we have yellow and then we have uh, green and then we have blue so you need to select all those colors which are available there and then for example i have a um, color uh, navy as well as peach so let's see if that is available here or not so peach is not available so that means we need to uh, add the new entry for that so for example I am uh, clicking here and then uh, here you can see I am uh, going to save the changes and then you should click on this color click on this uh, connect meta field so then after you should select this uh, color all right so right now you can see that we have the peach and navy navy was available but peach color is not available so how we can add that click on this peach and here you have to click on add peach and here we have the color palettes which you can select so for, for example i have this peach color so how we can i uh, how i can pick this color we have two methods the first method is like i can write here peach color hex code and then you will be getting this uh, color code and you can copy it and paste it right here uh, for example this one okay so this is one method another method is that you should right click on this image click on inspect so once you inspect then you should actually click here and for example i am writing color red okay so you should click on this color click on this pen and uh, pick up the color which you are interested to put so this is the color and here we have the hex code you need to copy this hex code and paste it right here so i pasted it and now you can see that the exact same color of our product is applied here all right then after we have for example a base color so that is basically uh, red you can select the uh, base color which is like matching with it then click on save once the changes are saved then you can click on done and click on save and let's see the preview now so click on this preview i am going back here and here we go now you can see that we have navy we have white we have peach we have blue color we have green color and we have yellow color all right so that's how we can actually add here the color uh, variants color swatches on our product page the next is that how we can add the images swatches so for say example i have another product here which is this one okay so we have uh, these three colors black white and ice blue so how we can add the swatches as a uh, image so you should go back to the dashboard click on products and here we have this product embody flared leggings scroll it down and again here you need to select the category i already selected the category so maybe let me change the category to apparel and accessories and then after click on save 
once the changes are saved then you can scroll it down and here you can see that we have a category matter field which is already selected here if that is not then you should click on color and it will be appearing here okay right now we have to uh, add here the entries uh, for example add new entry and here we have uh, to select the color so for example right now we have black white and ice blue so click here and uh, click here add new entry mm, right here black and select the image so you should click on select and scroll it down and here we have this black for example this image and automatically that image will apply okay and you can uh, select the base color automatically will be selected if not then you can select the base color and here we have some more options but right now we don't need to uh, do anything so here we have the black okay the second is again we have to click here add new entry and we have white so for the sake of adding white it is already added the uh, color so actually if we are selecting the image then color will be uh, automatically overrided so click on select image scroll a little bit down and here we go this is the image then click on save and the third option is click on add and uh, that is actually ice blue right ice blue click on add new entry and we have to write here ice blue and uh, you can um, add the color also if you want but right now we don't need any uh, kind of color so for example this is the color if we are not adding then still it is it doesn't matter click on select image because we are selecting the images so here we have the ice blue all right and then click on save so once you have selected all these then you should scroll it up and here you should click on this color and click on this connect meta field and click on this color so basically that's how we are connecting that uh, uh, category meta field with our colors and then click on done once you are done then you can click on save and then we can actually see the preview so let's see the preview now so here you can see that we have this product so here you can see that we have this product which was uh, like uh, color swatches and now if we are clicking on this pro product which is images swatches and here you can see that we have all these colors uh, but here we have the problem like why it is showing black uh, white in between this uh, white we don't have any image so uh, basically there is a conflict between uh, the uh, this white swatch and this uh, white images swatch so we need to make it different so this was exactly the same which is white and this is also the same name which is white so how we can solve this problem you should go back and here you should click on embody flared leggings scroll it down and click here and you should remove this for say uh, for now click on save save product and then after scroll a little bit down and here you can see that we have to add the new color so but we have to so once you are removing it then you should click again and click on uh, a new entry again click on add new entry and here you can write a different name white lagging okay and then you can change any of the uh, color for say example this is already selected so you can select the image scroll a little bit down and here we have this embody lagging and then you can click on save once the changes are saved then you can click on this save changes and click on done and let's see the preview now here we go now you can see that we have this ice blue this uh, lagging so let me go back here and here we need to select the image which is white lagging actually I deleted that swatch that uh, deleted that color and that's why it was not appearing here and I also need to add the quantity So I added the quantity now if you will uh, refresh here you will see that the color is actually modified and now we can see that which is white lagging 
and here we have ice blue we have uh, black and if we are going back to the home page if we are clicking on this product and now you can see that we have white swatch and everything is looking perfect which we were expecting all right so that's how you can actually add it into your store and if you want further customizations you can go back here and uh, let me see so you can see that we have variant picker you can make it square if you are clicking on square it is looking like this if you are clicking on drop down so it will look like this can you see here we go okay but for now we are interested to make it circle we are making uh, interested to make it pills but here you can also see it is uh, looking beautiful if we are making it drop down circle square and if we are putting it none then it removes all right so let's keep it pills with circle so finally we end up with the solution that we have implemented color swatches as well as image swatches in our shopify store so if you have any problem or something you can ask me directly i will help you out in that and thank you so much for watching this video if you are new on this channel then please subscribe this channel also like this video uh, you can follow me on tiktok instagram and facebook and you can also join the whatsapp group which i have created for uh, all my subscribers and if you have any problem or something you can directly contact me i have already added the contact details below in the description so you can message me you can also ask me questions below in the comment section if you have any new feature to develop then still i am here to help you out in that thank you once again see you in the next video